The plan by three countries under military rule in Africa, Mali, Burkina Faso and Niger to quit as members of ECOWAS is no doubt a blow to regional integration, defying pressure by leaders of the economic community of West African state ECOWAS to restore constitutional rule. Junta leaders of the three African countries feel they have nothing to lose by quitting the regional bloc. Galaxy News correspondent Levi Joseph has more on the development in this report. The economic community of West African states, ECOWAS Mingil, is to promote economic cooperation among member states in order to raise living standards and promote economic development. ECOWAS also has the mandate to address some security issues by developing a peacekeeping force for conflicts in the region. It established free trade area in 1990 and adopted a common external tariff in January 2015. But the 15 countries in the bloc are still struggling with socio-economic woes and security breaches. Very, very unfortunate that members are leaving. If there is any time for ECOWAS members to forge a united front, it is now that the sub-region is plagued, you know, with insecurity and human crisis of food, economic uh, downturn, and many other hills. So it's a very unfortunate uh, development. Nigeria and the rest of West Africa, it means that we are losing the very two important brothers who are supposed to be part of this union promoting economic integration in West Africa. And that implication means that relations between these three countries and West Africa control over the same. Who says that by the virtue of them quitting, they may even introduce visa policy, which of course may complicate free movement of goods and services between both countries. ECHO has moved to impose a raft of economic, political and financial sanctions on the three countries in a bid to force them to return to constitutional order has only worsened the situation. The junta say the sanctions are illegal and inhumane. To fight the terrorist group very successfully, you need a lot of collaboration. So by the implication of saying they are no longer members, cooperation between those who are quitting and those who are still in becomes a challenge. It means that that cordial relations will no longer be there. So West Africa, indeed, will suffer more in terms of trying to manage the security situation that have posed a serious challenge to the sub-region. In the current situation, ECOWAS as a body seems to be heal prepared. Uh, for instance, uh, it has been blind, so to say, to the, to the workings of France in its former colonies in these countries. And the presence of France, which was intended to help mitigate situations of crisis, has not helped. This development could impede economic cooperation within the bloc and as well as create bottlenecks for existing security networking which some of the member countries have been using to combat terrorism and insurgency. The junta said in a joint statement that ECOWAS had drifted from the ideals of its founding fathers and the spirit of pan-Africanism and accused the bloc of failing to assist in their fight against Islamic insurgents and ending insecurity. The level of suffering in this country, in these three countries we've mentioned, is unprecedented and the security situation has also got worse. So those who had worked with the civilian administration in these three countries, they felt very strongly that those who were in charge of the affairs of the state didn't do the right thing. Now, ECOWAS, given the ECOWAS traditions, maybe ECOWAS tried to go down all oh, the days of uh, uh, Sierra Leone, Liberia, among other things. But the dynamics have actually changed. Things are happening in the international system over the years, as we speak, one, two, three, four of them. Uh, supposed to be the need to change in the way we react to Issues. ECOWAS should explore new possibilities of rethinking its strategies. Okay? Uh, uh, as a regional body, uh, we are not just to wait for things to happen before you step in. That should, uh, it should be more proactive, it should be more strategic, and then it should offer relief um, opportunities for its members. 
rather than just slamming them with uh, sanctions when situations uh, arise 